vaccinator injector is useful when vaccinating or injecting large numbers of livestock. It allows the same dose to be given repeatedly to many animals. Many different designs of auto vaccinator injector are now available. Some are designed to attach to a draw off tube. Others are designed to draw the vaccine or antibiotic off and dispense metered dosages. Auto vaccinators have variable dose rates. Ensure that the vaccinator will deliver the correct dose for the vaccine you wish to use. Set the dose on the vaccinator. And using boiled tap water or sterile water, pump through at least 10 doses of the vaccine into a graduated measuring cylinder. A syringe with the plunger removed and the needle end blocked off will suffice. Ensure that the total volume dispensed is equal to the multiple of the doses dispensed. It may be necessary to get a new vaccinator if fine adjustment is not possible. So if you've vaccinated 10 animals with 2 mils each, you should have 20 mils in the syringe. Some vaccinator guns are specially designed to protect the operator against needle stick injuries by the use of a protective shroud that covers the needle between uses. Because of the wide range of vaccinator guns on the market, please read the directions for cleaning with each vaccinator. If a number of simple steps are followed, problems with vaccinator gun failure will be avoided and you can ensure your vaccinator gun has a long life. Only use dishwashing detergent to clean residues of vaccine from the vaccinator gun. Don't use harsh disinfectants. Once the vaccinator has been cleared of residue of previous vaccines, rinse it several times with clean water. Lubricate the vaccinator with castor oil. Sterilise the vaccinator by boiling or pumping boiling water through the apparatus for around 10 minutes. Place the vaccinator in a Ziploc bag for storage once cleaned and disinfected. Vaccines need to be kept cool and protected from light to ensure they remain effective. This needs to be done until the point of usage. This also allows reuse of open packs of some Pfizer vaccines within 30 days. Use a sufficient quantity of ice bricks Keep the vaccine cooler than 8 degrees for the time that you're using it. If working over a whole day, it may be necessary to replace ice bricks during the day or use a portable refrigerator to keep vaccine cool. The ESCII needs only to be big enough to hold the quantity of vaccine being used and an ice brick. I'm often asked, what's a vaccine holster and what is it used for? A range of vaccine holsters are on the market. They're designed to hold a pillow pack of vaccine and keep it cool. They're generally manufactured from special insulating materials designed to keep vaccines cool and to protect them from light. Uh... Vaccine holsters will only slow the heating of vaccine. Don't leave vaccine holsters out for extended periods especially in direct sunlight. Place them into an esky with an ice brick, if not being used for any period of time. Vaccines can be handled without the use of a vaccine holster. Place the vaccine in an esky when not in use. To get the most out of your Pfizer animal health vaccines, correct storage and handling are essential and following some simple guidelines, your vaccines will last longer and be more effective. Temperature affects all vaccines. Pfizer